everybody and welcome back to planet crafter we're gonna jump straight back in with our next episode okay i did a little couple of things during the break i did a couple more heaters and we actually unlocked on here the solar panels and then so what i did is i swapped out our wind turbines for the solar panels because these give so much more energy and then they're gonna help us continue to upgrade as we go along so i'm gonna try and get a couple more of those on the go um, mainly so that we can continue adding things because this game is all about continuing to add that heat, that pressure to up that TI index as we go through. Um, more silicon. Yes. And we need some more cobalt as well. So we're going to keep adding to it as we go along and then just try and keep on top of the power because we don't want to lose power and then because obviously if we lose power then our T and ti index doesn't go up until we get it up and running again so we want to try and keep on top of it and the reason why i got rid of the wind turbines is they don't offer a lot of power but we can get the resources back to upgrade to the next level each time so that's what we're going to try and keep on top of um how much does that give us now so now we've got 11.65 available power so can we get another heater in there we can there we go which is gonna keep why why have you moved over why are you in the in the wall now let's get you rebuilt a bit further over There you go. We can see a little bit better now. So we can see our heat is increasing. We can see that our pressure is increasing. But our row 2 is not going up very fast because we only have our little lonely, little lonely Lerma seed there. So we want to get some additional things going in there. But I might take that so I can craft some more water. And let's get rid of those two. Crafting additional water bottles. Because our water is going down and we'll have some food just to top that up a little bit. Okay. Now the bits I've brought out is because I'm working on my one, two, three, so I need another silicon and another iron. And we're gonna head over to this ship back here. or tips because obviously i'm learning this game as i go along and see apart from the two playthrough i haven't really played this game so any hints or tips you guys can give us for the game will be greatly received yeah that's good. I'll go there let's pop another one in there no pressing the wrong buttons pressing all the wrong buttons let's pop those two in there so yeah plenty of space because we're gonna go in this ship hit f because we're gonna need our torch it's, it's bright out here but we get inside and it goes all dark we're gonna have a little mooch around now there are areas within these ships as well that you can deconstruct to help you access other things and we have a crate here and there's a seed straight away we've got some fabric we've got some food 
for some other seeds. I'm going to grab all of that. And just so that I know that I've already checked that one, I'm going to deconstruct it. There's another crate over here. There's another seed. Great. This is really going to help increase our oxygen production. Another thing to deconstruct here. Another one. And, oh, what's this? Deconstruct here two heater okay so we haven't got enough room in our inventory for that and there's some more stuff back there as well so let's get back out try not to get lost top up our oxygen at the same time and store some of this stuff oh it's stuck on everything okay so what have we got we've got some iron got some seeds got some fabric and some food. Oh no, no I want to keep you. Now I might need a snack. Snugs. He loves snacks. I'm going to kind of. Ooh, all the seeds. That's really going to be useful. And a microchip. Yeah. And we've just unlocked tier two drills as well, which is going to be great. We can sort that out when we get back and upgrade our drills. What do I get if I deconstruct this? And I get all sorts of lovely goodies. I've got more stuff back there as well. Let's go and unload this stuff. Oh, no, we've got to go around this way. Through here. It's easy to get lost in these ships, so it's always good to carry spare oxygen tank with you or if it's a really big ship more okay, so we've already filled that one let's pop all that over there grab those three back out pop three more over blueprint microchip okay what do i need for a blueprint screen one iron one silicon so again this is going to draw off the power that we've already got in place but we can then grab the microchip. We can decode it here. What do we get? Agility boots tier one. So let's see what we need for them. Two aluminium and two fabric. Do we have? There's one aluminium, two aluminium, and two fabric. So this is this is quite good because this is obviously gonna save inventory space as well. Um can't upgrade. Oh, excess. No, we've already done that one. I don't think we can do much else at the minute. There's nothing else we can upgrade. We're going to leave that here because if we find other things as we go along, then we can decode them or we can craft things. Then uh, it, it just makes it a lot easier. It's less for me to carry back if I can sort it out while we're here. You know? Go back here and round here and over here and squeeze through. There's another microchip there. What's in here? Ooh, lots of things, including some super alloy. Nice. Got this one, more aluminium. Oh, we haven't quite got enough room for that. I can top up on a little bit of food so I can grab that. Let's restrict you. In fact, <laughs> I just realised because it gives me an iron every time I deconstruct one. Um, let's pop those in there. Pick up those two, pop those in there. You know, just keep the place tidy. And so we've got another storm coming in. Oh, it's making the whole ship shake. Scariness. And so we've got so many seats. I'm wondering. Again, that's that 
it's just kind of bringing some of the wintry down a tiny touch. So the things I want at the minute are all these seeds. These seeds for me are ube. Now I can't do anything with the growth of food for the minute, so I'm going to leave them here, I think. I've got a couple of eaters on the go. I'll leave them here for the minute. We can always come back and pick them up later. I'm going to... Oh, actually, I might... bits in there because I'd like to just grab a couple of cobalt and some ice and then we can make up some water and some oxygen just to leave in here as well you know to say we've always got that emergency extra one because say you you're wandering over and you get distracted by something you have to use one of your canisters or you forgot to drink before you leave and didn't bring one with you. At least there's something here that's ready to go, ready to grab. Pop those in there. Let me grab that fabric back out of there. So we'll take this stuff back home with us. Um, we've got some bits and pieces there. I'm still increasing that TI index because I put a couple of heaters in there when I was on there. Look at the mess these little mini meteor asteroid things have made. <laughs> it sounds like we've got another storm coming in. I want to get out. And we're back here. I love the fact that we have more storage in the other place than we actually have here. <laughs> Definitely need some iron. So we are going to have to get some more solar panels on the go as well. Still keeping things going up. We are going to work on our veggie tubes here too. So I think we're going to need some more ice for them. I don't know. Got any ice? No. Let's grab some ice. So then we'll swap out that veggie tube, veggie tube tier one for a better one as well. Hydration level is low, so I'm gonna grab that quickly. What else are we gonna need for our veggie tubes? We're gonna need some iron, some magnesium, some silicon. So we'll grab those 
bits and pieces while we're out as well. And obviously we can deconstruct the one we've already got. Yeah, just get some titanium as well while I'm at it. Why not? I actually like English proper. I don't English proper. Let's, what have we got? 150%, 200%. Let's grab one of those because that is the highest one we've got at the minute. And then grab the lemon seed out of this one, the of this one. And then pop a little. Ooh. Low power again, but that is fine because. We knew that was going to happen. Let's pop that lemon seed in there. Yeah, let's go grab some more cobalt. I see you. And obviously, the higher tier your other stuff becomes, the more power it uses as well. So, what else do we need? Got everything. Let's pop another one here. We'll grab some more silicon. So we need like magnesium and silicon anyway for our veggie cubes. So. Grab some bits and pieces. Keep us going. And obviously at the side a lot of it is us basically gathering resources, getting things to go in. And, uh, and keep pushing those indices upwards. Oxygen is now increasing. Brilliant. We've got that on the go. Our pressure's increasing. Our heat is increasing, but at a slower rate. Still got plenty of power. When do we get our next heat as well as our oxygen increases? We're about to get an indoor ladder. Needs to go a little bit further for us to get tier 2 heater. We do have backpack tier 3 though, so what do we need for that? of aluminium. sparse around um, the base itself. We did have a lot of uh, asteroid even tearing things. That's, that's what they call them. So we can expand, expand out then we can get some more heaters, we can get some more veggie tubes, we can start playing around with our base a little bit. 
going to grab some cobalt while we're out because then we can also keep an eye on the solar panel situation. to that other pod so we can deconstruct the heaters over there and bring the stuff back for them so it's three heaters in there now three of the big ones so we can see that our heat is increasing this is good this is good i'm liking this that oxygen production on the rise and that can't be constructed until I remove the seed. Oh, 
up in glass, we've got communications antenna, so things are definitely starting to be starting to unlock right now. Screen transmissions. Let's have a look. This thing's going crazy at the minute. Okay, so like we are flying up on the pressure right now. This one is unlocking first. Oxygen's climbing, yeah. So we want to see these numbers moving. Our pressure is going up, but a little bit slower. Don't get another drill for a while, yet. Ooh, in your oxygen tank in a little while. Terraformation is climbing, that's what we want to see. So I'm not going to worry too much about... Well, I should I might. This, I know, takes quite a bit of power, though. silicon silicon and magnesium iron silicon magnesium we need a little silicon so we are definitely gonna need some solar panels as well at the minute once we get the tier two solar panels that'll help out Definitely making progress. We are not far from that's that next level of solar panels. Let's. We've got two screens we can make actually. I just noticed. We've got the progress screen as well. Lovely. We're nine percent of the way to blue skies. Now I need more silicon. So just make that one. Darn it! <laughs> we got some silicon down here. I'll grab a couple of it. Only because I only have space to grab. As we go through, our base will become more interesting, more attractive. Is this an expensive screen compared to the others? Like, that, that takes two silicon, iron, and magnesium. That was only iron and silicon. There's our solar panel too. I 
would also very much like a Fitbit. You know, I'm doing a lot of walking right now. Uh, it doesn't matter which way around these faces. I'm gonna put that there. And then... What other thing is? And then just to show you, these produce 19.5 and these ones are 6.5. So huge increase. Skeleton as well. Nice. And we've got that. So we've got that on us. Lovely. They are current exoskeleton is rather full. So it might be an idea to upgrade this. So titanium silicon. Oh, we can't do it just yet because we've got no aluminium. We haven't got anything else to pop on it just yet. So also not an issue. We've still got one slot. Wow, we're getting all the blueprints, guys. All the blueprints. Okay, so what are we on? We are on just over half an hour, so I am going to leave it there for the end of this one. We have made some huge progress, though. Like, we have oxygen increasing. We have heat increasing. The pressure is increasing. It's a little bit slower than I want it to be, but we will get working on increasing that exponentially during the next episode but i hope you enjoyed this if you did make sure to hit that like button hit the subscribe if you haven't already done so you know every little bit helps and it's free it doesn't cost anything but it means so so much to me i'm just watching this ti like go up it's over twenty six thousand at the minute i'm loving it and that but yeah i I am enjoying this game as well. And as I say, if you've got any hints, tips, anything like that that you want to share, feel free to because it is all, it's all about the learning experience and playing together. But in the meantime, thank you so much for joining us. It's been a lot of fun. I will see you again soon. You take care. Bye-bye.